Hey everybody, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. It's Jesse here from Badger Nerdworks. I'm here with Brandon and Finn, and hey, we're going to get right up? back into this. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong, and he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? Javier Escuela. You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. <laughs> I know. The situation were reversed. He'd look for me. Yeah, he will look for you eventually. Thank you. <laughs> All the way down into Mexico. Get this caught way. in the revolution. Best I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Well, it wouldn't be the first time. Well, that's interesting. So John had left the gang at least once before he makes his final exit. It seems kind of foolhardy to send your next best two guys out into the frigid cold. If you're like, to man, for this dude. yeah, we already lost the strongest one. Right. Well, on, this dude who let's also, go, as they just got through person. saying, has like taken off before. Well, right. So, Somebody left. I mean, kind of at that point, I think you're just like, well, if he comes back, he comes back, and he's dead, whatever. That way. Sure, well, come on there. There's some tracks leading to the river. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. Oh man, that water's gotta be so cold. Yeah, no doubt. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Watch out for this crevice. Yeah, it does fall off. Killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. So we'd not get that close to that cliff. The cliff wall here. <laughs> right. Well, just, you don't know how much that snow and ice. Both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. And snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. It is a really beautiful effect of that blowing wind on like his little cape poncho thing yeah, that's going yeah. on. The way the characters lean against the wind and block right. their faces. Yeah. It's pretty neat. Yeah, for a game that's so much of it's about traveling, like they did a great job of making the environments. Like really pleasurable to look at. Like even when they came through that little cove and opened up into the hillside, you're like, oh, yeah. it's beautiful, man. It looks like it looks like a western. You yeah, know? yeah, exactly. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, no doubt. 
Although right now I'm waiting for a wizard to bring snow all over me. Right. <laughs> Forces to go through Moria. Got some freaking hobbits. <laughs> you shall not bang, 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 bang. <laughs> Well, I mean, this world has already proven that zombies <laughs> can be in it, so why not cowboy wizards? <laughs> Look, they had a fancy gold ring. <laughs> I'm a cowboy wizard. Let's see if he can hear us. Right. Come on. Oh, that's I'll cool. Poor thank over there. <laughs> it's a little bit creepy that their attention to detail went so deep into like How the animal, yeah, the animal corpses, yeah. Corpses are, yeah, no doubt. I think you're going to be saying that a lot <laughs> as the gameplay goes on there. Who knows what's up ahead? Yeah, get shotgun. It can get pretty gruesome from what I've seen. Getting that gun then? Huh. That is not a shotgun. No, it is not. <laughs> At least not what I was expecting. That's <laughs> barely a shotgun. It's it's the what start of a hit shotgun with this out here. <laughs> it's what shotguns grow up to be. <laughs> This is part in the X Games. The slipper, mm. be careful. How are you gonna get back up that? Tony Hawk snowboarding. Yeah, you know we're high up here. <laughs> You're telling me. Sean White's chilling out here. <laughs> right. Yeah. Sean White's extreme snowboarding challenge. Careful. There's a drop here. By EA Sports. <laughs> <laughs> Out here. Yeah, because that is a long way yeah, down. Yeah, man. Stay low under here. Hey, stay low. Right, under touch the place you to that crouch. You're gonna have to crouch under. Right. Okay, from here. Thanks, fucking ob obvious. Watch your step. Escuela. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. All right. Learning stuff. <laughs> Bop it. Now. Twist it. Come on. That's pretty cool. Coming, parkour! Get that parkour. Yeah. Oh, hey, you're gonna rescue John. Heartwarming moment. I can jump, but I can't run. Yeah, I won't run there. Like, I mean, just that close to a... Doing? <laughs> miserable. <laughs> yeah, this sucks. I know. It's cold. I'm freezing. You're walking around in snow. Oh well, that'll fix it up. Nice. Right. Yeah. Thin your blood. Oh. F the rest of that bottle. Come on. Come on. Or maybe you both just drank oh, half of a yeah, half a bottle of whiskey between yeah. the two of you. Make this rescue mission more fun. Yeah, I mean, you are staying next to a ledge. It won't be a little more short-footed than drunk, but teach their own. These guys are clearly not good at making good decisions. That's not their forte. Well, and as I've said before, uh, Rockstar Games don't know how That's drinking works. <laughs> like, never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. It's John, and it's how he got his scar. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> and stating the obvious. <laughs> don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, 
madre. Uh, mission accomplished. Yay. He's not dead. Let's try this way. Apparently oh, not. Yeah, Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Yeah, Dutch should listen, man. Yeah, no doubt. I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us I, out. You know, honestly, having known as much as I do about the first game, Dutch's leadership is all, should have always been called into question. Uh, that's creepy. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> yeah, indeed. It ain't gonna work out real well. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. All right, John, come on. Let's get you on that horse. Go come on, wolves. doggies. All right, everyone wants to fight a three dogs with two rounds. It's three dog night. Nice dodge. Yeah, dude, no doubt. Reload, reload. <laughs> oh. Yeah, dude. Yes. Can you scan him? Well done, sir. Uh, I don't think it's gonna let me here. Yeah, probably not. You're in kind of in the middle of some story shit. But of all the times you'd want food, <laughs> right? No doubt. <laughs> like, could we use some skins and food? Right. Kind of stuck here on the side of this cliff. Like, yeah, we'd fall freeze to death before we got done with that. Right. That was it, just three wolves? Yep. Well, I mean, we're still, like, early on in the game. Man. I don't feel too good. Yeah, I think that's... You haven't even gotten into town or anything. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, little fella got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. No, death is going to come much, much slower than that for you right. guys. Oh, God, much more <laughs> horribly. Up there? Like, more of so, all many, right. so many more bullets. Like, all dogs. the bullets. Hey, that nice, was nice. Dude. Yeah. Headshot. Bang, bang. Look out on the right. We got more wolves on the left. Yeah, both sides. They're coming in from either side of you. Nice. Oh yeah. You see any more? Good shin tags. Don't think so. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? <laughs> Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says I'm lucky. None of us are lucky right now. My gun is frozen. Should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Right. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. <laughs> so, freezing. I don't like this plan star. of light water rapiding our way there, back home. The death ain't good enough for you. <laughs> Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, let's get yeah, out of the really extremely cold water. This makes me feel bad for the horses. Yeah, no doubt. See like, those buildings up ahead, John. So cold. Nearly there. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Hello? Anybody home? Did you all die while we were gone? Do we Come on, help him down. They all turned into zombies. Here we go. There we go. Ay, careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new life, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other 
lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch what's, talk about that, we're gonna get what's out. What's with the nerdy guys? Just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The <laughs> west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Mogan. <sighs> And here Strauss does book work, I guess. I don't know. What's so what's this gonna... gang all about, dude? This is the weirdest, most jumbled ass like. We have been running for weeks. It's a weird we gang. Shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping. For. It's almost like they're less a gang and more like a commune. Take all your stuff. All right. Oatcakes. Okay. You sound doubtful. Not doubtful, just worried. What do you think, Arthur? Well, I wasn't on that boat, so hard to say. But I trust your judgment, Dutch. Always have. Thank you, son. You probably shouldn't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You know you're all freezing to death in the right. wilderness, right? And it's this guy's leadership that got you here, so... It sounds like he executed a little kid, so... Yeah, that too, right, yeah. No, he did. Girl's eyeball was hanging by a thread from what I remember of the first game. <laughs> Let's go in here and see what... I doubt that was the intention, but it was definitely the outcome. Right. like action! Couple of days on the well, but you know, it, it's either it's either the reasons for it are either Shut you know up, appalling, like so bloodlust, or, 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 or stupidity. And so <laughs> you know, yeah, like stupidity kind of calls that dude's leadership ser into serious question. Probably, funny, sure. Oh shit. I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? There's Dan no Driscoll. We got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Comb? always had good information come on and you think now is the right time to hit a train now Sweet. you might fancy <laughs> living on deer piss and rabbit shit train robbery. i'm getting too old for that life mr matthews mr smith mr pearson would you please look after the place there are o'driscoll's about <laughs> Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this store of their planet. Hey, you're just pretty dreadful people in this game. Like, yeah. you know... Get them before they That's get us. That's the thing. It's like, you know, it depends on, like, I mean, some of them in the group are pretty dreadful, I'm sure. You know, but, like, there are others, like Arthur, that aren't too bad. But Dutch, you know, Dutch is a shit heel. <laughs> well, it's like, it seems like they got their families along. Right. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. Well, at least you know you're a fool. <laughs> right. Of course. Your Listen, words. I 
know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this'll end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Well, this is just one of those things, like, unless they get them all, of course they're going to come after you after this. Yeah. Arthur! Somehow I doubt... Right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're going to head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Okay, Let's so go. the dude there, uh, yeah, one of those guys is Bill Williamson. Do you have the rifle with you? I won't let me check on it. Oh. Because it seems like... That'd be the thing to do. Have a rifle, that is. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? Those jerk faces. So. It's four or five. Yeah, that's him. Six. I can count six of them. Maybe seven. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. They're not happy they indeed. Even? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right, let's go pay our old friends a visit. It's on my horse. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okie dokie. You two get up there and keep us covered. <laughs> sure thing. It's down in the slot on your left. Or that one, yeah. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said. Revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Yes. Our needs <laughs> right now are supplies. Um, I mean, that's probably like the whole point of, of this game, so yeah. Everything else, including <laughs> calm, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. That'd make the game too simple if we just shot him in the head from here. Right. Like, oh, our enemy's leadership is no more. Right. 
We're out. Deuces. They'd all be standing around like, where'd that come from? I don't know. <laughs> Are we still getting paid? No, I think I'm gonna go home then. <laughs> Steep here. Careful. Did anyone else know the plan? <laughs> no, our leadership is very, very vague with its people. Right. They speak in riddles. Yeah, because it's not like these guys have like a plan, like a short-term goal that they've set. Mm -hmm. It's like, well, uh, I don't know. And assumed, pro you know, assumed statements like, you know, we must deal with the whole Williamson Maybe problem. You know, it's like, well, how? What do you mean? They're deal with it? How? <laughs> No, but the way our luck's been running, hush. Let's just get down there first. <laughs> down through these trees, quick. Are you asking important questions you'd really need to know the answers to? Just hush up. Right, shut up for right now. <laughs> but I mean, shouldn't we have a that strategy can't be revealed if we're in the, in the game? <laughs> if we're going into this, shouldn't we have a plan of attack? Yeah, we're going to shoot all of them. You're like, right? Well, yeah, but... <laughs> I mean... That less... much was obvious, but I mean... A little less vague, maybe. <laughs> you know, like, actual tactics, like... Who's going to take what positions, and... So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Wow, that's real leadership. <laughs> right? Make the call, Arthur. Okay, I'll go first. I don't want to give him a haircut. Now you're going to give him a fucking ear exam with a bullet. Ha! <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> Man, you guys really were at a numerical disadvantage, weren't you? Oh. oh! Dude, yes! I really like oh. that that guy got hit mid-step and just kept stammering forwards. Right. Like he was dead, but he didn't quite know it yet. My count was completely off. I don't think all of them had spawned when you were looking at them. No. Yeah, obviously. Well, and again, there's some in the buildings, so... Yeah. Like, like, uh... Dutch keeps yelling at me. Dutch was like, sure, we're out number two to three to one. Right, yeah, let's well, do let's... this. This is... Man, Dutch, you are just... You deserve an award for your leadership. And it seems You're like so fucking good. And this seems like the plan was to bunch up in like the center of the camp. Right? Yeah, no doubt. Let's get into one area where oh. we can get completely surrounded. It's pretty Let's sweet. Let's make that our rally point. <laughs> yeah. God, Dutch, you're such a great leader. All right, Robin bodies. He's really into the math. Alright, Robin bodies. He's really into math. 